Okay, okay, so we're going to make a bubble today for a hat like this. So this is a pom-pom on the top of a hat which we've sewn on and we're going to show you a really easy way to make a pom-pom. So we've got a variety of pom-poms we've already made here and you can make any kind. So this is like a speckled one with two colours in it. You can do a kind of half and half version like this. It's almost like a stripe in it. What kind or of yarn this, have you well, used? This, well this has to be wool because what we're going to do is, is wash it. So if you use synthetic fibre, it doesn't um, wash so well. Although having said that, this was cotton. And in fact, that's not bad actually. So this it is possible, but maybe you need to make it a bit denser. I'm going to show you um, a kind of fairly sort of small thing that fluffs up much bigger because it's washed. So this is lamb's wool and we're using a bull winder. And this is the magic ingredient that makes it fast. So first of all, we're going to put on one colour and we're going to make it about half a centimetre thick of wool. It doesn't take very long. So we're just going to make a pom-pom that's like a bit like this one where it's kind of half red, half blue. So I'm just checking how much it is. That's about right. So this is about half a centimetre here of thickness and we're just going to put on the blue on top round about the same amount again so what's cool about using the ball winder is you could actually put like three ends of color through or five ends of color or two together there's no rules you can do what you like and obviously the more ends you put through the faster the ball is made So this is about a centimetre thick on here and I'm just going to take it off and then what you do is get the same colour that you've just made the ball in, get about four ends of that colour, so I've just put all those colours, all the threads together, then you make a knot through the middle of the ball. Try and get that quite tight. I'm doing a double knot. Get a bit tangled up. There we are. And then what you do is split the ball um, roughly opposite where you've made that knot. So here, so here's the knot, here's the cut. And then what you have to do is just teasel out those strands so they're not crossing over anymore. The ball winder will always cross the yarn but for this we actually want it uncrossed. So you just work like this until the strands are straight. It doesn't take very long. Yeah. Here's one I've already done so it needs to look like this which looks a total mess but it's going to be fine. So um, let's go down to the wash area. So, um, okay, so what we're going to do is hand wash this. So we get warm water, hand hot water, pop the weird looking ball in the water, put a little bit of detergent with it. And then what you do is just wash it um, so it's completely sort of soaked, but also sort of rub the thing together a little bit so that all the ends, those cut ends of yarn start to fluff up like this. Yeah. And the more you do this, the more fluffy the pom-pom will be. But actually I quite like them a bit kind of ragged looking, so I'm not doing it that much. But it's entirely up to you. So you keep doing it like this. Just when you're ready, just rinse out the excess detergent. And you're left with that. Okay. And then you put this in the dryer. Oh, sorry, spinner. the spinner. Yeah. Put it in the spinner first, get the water out. And then you put it in the dryer over here. And we dry it for like a couple of minutes on a hot setting. And then you get a fluffy ball, which is you know, like the one we're going to put on. 
Now this has the strands still attached like we've got here. And we're going to use those to actually attach the pom-pom to the hat. So we're just going to go back down and put it in the hat. So the way you can attach it is, this is a really simple hat, it's like a tube that we've gathered at the end, so it's a really basic, simple bobble hat. You just pop a latch tool through the crown, either side of the crown, so we've got the latch tool here, we grab one end that's securing the pom-pom, take it through the crown, go the other side of the crown, grab the other end of yarn, take it through to the back and then inside the hat you've got those two ends and all you do is to simply just tie them together double knot and then snip it off and you're done and there's your mother hat.